Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Satisfactory. Okay, we got our Mark II conveyor belts done. I just sent off the pod. What did I send that off for? I honestly don't know what I sent that off for. I forget. It just came back. Oof. Oh, I sent it off for the Mark II stuff. Duh. Alright, what else do we have left? Oh, we're done. So now we gotta complete the space elevator stuff. Let's go check on that. I think we need a rotors? If I'm not mistaken. Let's go check. I thought we needed like just 50 rotors for this. Oh my god, it's so foggy. This looks awesome. There's an update that downloaded for me before I played this. So I'm wondering if there's some sort if there's like bug fixes or if they added stuff. I should check on that. On the Epic Game Store, it's not very clear on if there's like patch notes or something. Okay, so what do we need? 50 smart plates. Oh. And we need a pipe bin to the back side, right? Yep. Alrighty. So let's head back. Let's check on our smart plating. We probably have like two. So since that's probably going to take a while, maybe we work on this second iron line coming in. Oh, we're going to need a crap ton of power, too. I need a lot of organics and stuff. That's why I really wish we could unlock coal or natural gas. I don't even know what's in here anymore. This is all running still, it looks like. Okay, so that's good. So does all this have power? That'd be the next hold up. I think this is the smart plating. Oh, wow, only seven. We're waiting on reinforced plates. Why are we waiting on reinforced plates? Oh, they're just slow. We're waiting on iron plates. Okay. Let me make sure all these have power. Yeah, they're good. So we're waiting on iron plates. So this is making iron plates. It's just slow. What are we making here? We're making iron plates, iron rods and screws, and then iron rods. So we need another set of iron plates probably coming out. How many iron plates are in storage? 69. I kind of just want to take those and throw them upstairs. And let's just throw it straight into the... What is it? The assembler to make reinforced plates? Let's just throw these in there. Now the smart plating came out. Yeah, let's just throw all these plates in there. That'll get this working for a bit. That'll make what? 13? 14? 15? Something like that. Reinforced plates with just that 100 I threw in there. So that'll be good. But even then, half of them are getting diverted over here for... Ugh, modular frames. Yeah, so we need a lot more iron. So I think we definitely need to bring in that second line. Uh, let's sort this real quick. Compress that. It kind of makes me want to take away this copper production because it is taking up a lot of space down here I gotta make sure I don't die from falling and bring in a second iron line and have the iron line over there and maybe we make copper production like over there instead yeah I think we do that so let's yeah let's repurpose this okay so let's take out all of this copper we can actually leave this here we're just taking out this copper line and then i think i'll build a secondary facility over here to process just copper and this facility is basically going to be iron we'll pump copper into here if we need it like if we need to pipe pipe in copper plates or sheets or whatever they're called things like that but we'll leave that there okay so then this line will come in and then it'll shoot over here. We could just straight up duplicate it, right? Like take this exact setup, go to the next floor and like duplicate it all. So I have to, well, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. All right. Uh, I need to take all this copper out, switch this over to iron. We're good on copper for the time being, so I'm not too worried about it. Iron, iron, and iron. 
and more iron. All right, now I need to take all this copper out of here. Dang it. Here, give me, give me this copper. Give me, give me, give me. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. Where's it coming from? There's no more. How's it still pumping out? This must have an internal buffer of like 20 or something. All right, all that's cleared out. Whoop. All right, that's done. What? Where'd that come from? Ah, oh, come on. There you go. All right, so this should all be ready to take in copper. Or iron, I mean. So it goes this way. I don't know. I have that there. Okay, so then that'll go up. Now, do I really just duplicate this? Oh, boy. What do I do? What do I do? I could... Have this line... Like, say I take this out. And I don't do storage for screws. I don't do storage for iron. Well, I guess this is a buffer, right? This is just gonna buffer everything. Uh, as I say, maybe we don't take iron rods or iron plates. Like we don't store some and we have this make iron plates. But then the question is, do we need iron plates for anything? Because then we shoot up the second line over here. I think we have enough room just to duplicate everything. So this is still making reinforced plates. Probably don't have a whole lot of smart plates. Oh, yeah. And then even half of the reinforced plates are being saved. Okay. So that's why every third one is only going over here. So that's why that's taking forever. And we need 50 of them. All righty. What's this again? Rotors. Okay, rotors are fine. So it seems like we just need a lot of reinforced plates. That seems to be the holdup. So maybe this other line, we just have it spit out reinforced plates. Maybe that's what we do. Let's go with that. Let's just not duplicate this. Let's just have this other line make straight up reinforced plates. So reinforced plates are what? Let's see, reinforced plates are plates plus screws, so we need... Okay, so we're gonna need the same sort of things again. We're gonna need... Actually, no, what we can do is... Two lines, so we can have like a left line to make plates, a right line to make plates, and the middle line will make screws, because we won't need rods to make reinforced plates. We need rods to make screws to make reinforced plates. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Oh, this is pretty much set up then. So let's do production iron plates. This will make rods. This one will also make iron plates. I'm gonna have to figure out what to do with all this storage of stuff. Yeah, cause I have to clear this out cause we can't pump stuff up if there's other stuff in there. But then this one will make screws from the rods. All this goes up, I think. We might have to rotate this? Right, because there's machinery right above me. Yeah, we can't bring this straight up because there's machinery. Could bring it up over there though. So that should be fine. We'll leave it like that. Um, Let's go down. Actually, do I have plates? I need plates. I need plates so I can make a bunch of conveyor belts. Let's get some plates. Take all those. All right, so that line's going perfectly fine. Snap that there. See how far we can get it. Eh. Looks like right about there. I don't think this is going to make it too long. Nope. 
Too long. All right. So let's do like there and then we'll raise it up and then we'll go from there. Let's come around here. Right in there. Beautiful. All right, and then let's go put power in this mine because I'm pretty sure we unhooked it all. I don't have wire. Dang it. Dang it. I need wire. Oh, what am I doing? That's not, that's not the, the ramp. All right, I need wire and probably cable as well. Shouldn't need a whole lot of either though. Just a little bit, like one stack, if that quarter of a stack. There we go, and wire. All right, let's go power that mine. Somehow it didn't take damage on that one. All right, this should just be getting whatever iron is out of this mine right now. Whatever 100 are stuck in there, and then that's it. It'll probably end after that. Oh, wait, this is hooked up. Okay, this is just out of power? Wait, I thought I just saw the wire go into it. Oh, no, I was seeing a wire through that. Okay. So, yeah, this one just goes like that to there. There we go. Beautiful. Yeah, we turned on just in time. Nice. Alrighty, let's go, let's go. So let's give this some power. Uh, split it. Let's just give it 25 for now. That should get all of these constructors going. Wait, do I not have power on these? What? Iron ore. This is iron ore, right? Hello? Why is this not taking? Is, it, is there a copper? There is a copper stuck in it. Aha! You have to process the copper that's stuck in it. There we go. Oh wait, I need that copper then. No! Where is it? It's gonna come out. There it is. Another one coming? There they are. There's the iron. All right, then this one's probably stuck as well. Let me just turn it off. Oh, wait, no, oh, 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 give me that. I don't wanna deal with having to go chase down the copper coming out. All right, so if I'm quick enough, I should be able to grab it. There we go. All right, so now all those should be producing iron. Should see iron come out of that in a second. Why isn't... What? Oh, I didn't switch it. There we go. Ton of iron coming out now. All right, let's head upstairs. Let's head upstairs. Ton and ton of iron production right now. All right, that iron comes up here. We should be making plates, screws, plates. Uh, I think we just take all this stuff right now. Like, take what we can out of here. Ooh, we're gonna have to put all this in the storage boxes downstairs. Oh, I need some jump pads, because walking up that ramp, it's getting old quick. Can I use this one? Here we go. Uh, let's do... That, the ore, I'll we'll do cable, wire. All right, let's go back up. I think we're gonna do jump pads soon here. I think I just need like a lot of reinforced plates, was it? What is it for jump pads? Is it in this menu, transportation? Aha, jump pad. Yeah, reinforced plates and rotors. Or is that just iron plates? Was that just iron plates? It was. Okay, so that is a reason why we need to keep that over there feeding us a separate storage of just plates. Because at some point, we need them to build little things like that. 
All right, take all this, put the screws back. Take all that, put the plates back. We can actually just put all the plates in there. It's fine. Oh, no, no, oh, man. Here, plates go back, there we go. So plates, screws, and plates, nice. All right, so the plates and the screws. Let me see. Let's go upstairs and look at the process for making reinforced plates, shall we? Reinforced plates, six plates, 12 screws. And screws pop out four at a time? Ugh. See, this is the thing where it's like too much for me and I'm probably just gonna wing it. It's not gonna be the prettiest, but I'll just wing it. I'm thinking we just take both sets of plates that are being constructed. We merge them and shove them all into here with screws. Or I guess with the amount of screws that we're producing. Maybe we split off this screw line again. Because look like the, these are stopped with the amount of screws up here. And we have so many screws sitting in there. But then again, maybe that's just because we have, we were short on plates, so screws were piling up at that point. Yeah, this is out of power, so let me repower this. Uh, there is 19, sure. All right, so we're gonna need like an assembler. I guess just one assembler. Because all we want is reinforced plates. And then I guess we pump the reinforced plate. Oh, God, this is getting confusing. We could pump the reinforced plates here and take this out. So that way every other plate is going here for smart plating. Huh. All right, let's just, let's just do it. Let's just do something. Missing iron plates, oh, of course. Well, good thing we're making a bunch now. So we need conveyor lifts, logistics. Let's just do, do we do Mark IIs now? And I guess we try to do it as far over as we can, right? I don't, I don't even know how I'd position this. Oh, that's pretty cool. I didn't know you could go like that or something. That's pretty awesome. Never realized I could rotate that. Actually, I think we had this all the way in the back. Uh, where's... Sure. I don't have to work. Oh, need more reinforced plates. We should have some upstairs, right? Right? They should be this one? 22, alrighty. I guess we're just gonna use Mark 1 conveyor belts for now. That's gonna be where we draw the line. Approaching clearance. Oh, too far back? Really? All right, so plates, plates, screws. Or actually we could save some resources there. We could just go this straight over here. I think if I take this and put this here and that there. And then we're going to need something like a merger.
You know what? That intersects, but I really don't care. So then this one, I'll have to do something like... Make that go up. So that line will merge there. This line will come out. Just trying to get nice little tight curves here. There we go. And then that goes up. There you go. Plates and screws going up into two separate lines. And now we just throw that into assembler and make a crap ton. Oh, come on. It totally looked high enough. Alrighty. Well, what we will do then, I guess I should have made it from up here, right? There we go. Oh, come on, and I don't have room for all these screws. Well, is there a way for... Can I just drop stuff? I need this, and I need that. All right, there we go. There we go. That's not even, is it? Uh, is that on the same level? No. You know what? You know what? We'll go upstairs and do it. We'll go upstairs and make it then. All right, conveyor mark two. Much easier when I can see what I'm doing. Oh, now, now you're gonna be a problem, huh? That should clear that now. Perfect. Alrighty, so we got a line, line of plates. I gotta not forget that wire or cable. Line of plates, line of screws. So now if we just go... I almost just wanna feed this directly into here for smart plating. How much do we need for this for modular frames? We need three though. Yeah, let's do that. Here, let's do this. Take this off. Take this off. Take this off. Since this needs so much reinforced plates, we'll just straight up connect that. That way that can have all of its reinforced plates go straight there. And then what we'll do is we will make an assembler right here. It's gonna be a little backwards, but you'll see, you'll see. I think, eh, I like that, that's fine. Um, this could probably go like this, and then this one can go something like this. I think that'll have to go there, and this one. Well, let me just build this line. All right, so that's gonna be plates. And this will be the screws. Oh, give me some plates. Give me, give me, give me. That'll be screws. And this will make Reinforce plates. And then when those pop out, we will go this way. And we'll split it. Half will go into storage. The other half will go into here. Because this only needs one reinforced plate. Whereas I'd rather have all the reinforced plates for this go here. Since this needs three at a time. Should be a lot better. Alright, we do need power for this, right? So that's 1530, right? 1530. Yeah, so this needs a separate power too. Dang. 
Dang, dang, dang. All right. Biomass burner. Where are you going? I guess right here? Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, God. It doesn't fit. Can it fit in the middle? Nope. All right. Oh. Oh, I can't afford it. Plates and rods, that said? Screw it. I'll just take all these plates. Got a ton of them. Gimme, 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 gimme. All right, got a bunch. Let's get some rods. Sure, that works. What else do I need? Plates, rods, we got wire. We're good, we're good. All right, here we go, biomass. This doesn't fit here, right? Can't afford. Oh, missing another plate. There we go. So this can just straight connect there. And then if we turn this bad boy on, should start making reinforced plates like crazy. Let's get logistics. We need a splitter. So this come out, go in there. I need more plates. Give me plates, give me plates. Plates, 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 plates. I need a lot of plates. 20? Will that do it? Not sure if that'll do it. That goes there. And that goes there. Nice. There we go. So that iron mine, that secondary mine, is basically just making me reinforce plates. That's its only job. And we'll see how this works in terms of like screws versus plates. Let's let this run for a quick sec. Let's see how this works. So we had 12 screws left. Let's see if we get to 24. Looks like we'll just about get there. Oh wow, so screws are actually perfect. No way. 60 per minute is what we need. And how many are we producing? Are we really producing 60 per minute? 40 parts per minute. What? Uh, we're out of power. Of course. Everything's always out of power. Now that's only making 40 per minute. But then I don't know if 40 parts per minute means 40 individual screws or 40 sets of four. Huh. If there's 40 sets of four, that'd be 160 screws we're making a minute. But then why is this like lining up perfectly? Oh, it's lining up perfectly because this conveyor, right? Can only produce 60 resources a minute. That's why. If we upgraded that conveyor pull belt, this would go faster. And we got way too many iron plates coming in. Because we are making how many iron plates a minute? 40 per minute, 20 on each line. And how many do we need? Or can I take these? Yeah, so how many do I need on each line? I need 30 per minute. So we have an extra 10 plates per minute that are coming in here, right? We're using 30 per minute, per, we're producing 40 per minute in that line down there. I guess that's fine. If I really wanted exact, I would split that line up twice into four separate lines. So that way each line is 10 per minute. Combine the three back down to one to get 30, and then that extra 10 goes off into storage, but I don't know if I care that much. This should be good. We should be pumping out smart plating like crazy. Or not smart plating, uh, reinforced plates like crazy. And then, yeah, now we got a lot more in here for smart plating. Beautiful. That's what I want. I want this just constantly producing smart plating for me. So if I check that storage, where are we at? We need 50. Nice. We're at 30. Much better. Much better. 
And how are the modular frames going? Oh, oh. What? I put... Didn't I put power in this? Alright, well, where's our... How many modular frames we got? We only got 14. Alrighty. Well, I think that's gonna do it for today. I guess we got the other iron mine set up, so that should help us out with getting our smart plating so we can send it off on the space elevator. That'll probably take another episode for all that to process and get me 20 more smart plating. So in the meantime, I think we'll make our secondary factory for copper production. We don't need a whole lot of copper production going on right now, but we might as well set that up now rather than later, just so we have it. And I think we just build it right out there. That looks like a nice spot out there. So we're gonna do that in the next episode, get a whole bunch of concrete, make a foundation, make a small factory out there. And we'll be back. But also, I'm also going to have to get a ton. A ton more biomass. Because, yeah, we're out. That 500 biomass fuel or whatever I had. That's gone. So, yeah, probably on the next episode, we'll do some of that. We'll get to work on the copper factory. But until then, take it easy, everyone.